what you heard, but we just want to bring you back a new friend. I know it can't understand me, but maybe it responds good to soothing tones. song or something we can sing to kill the time. Ooh, ooh, I know one. It's called... Please Stop. Right, yeah. Okay. Wait, is Please Stop the name of your song? No. Okay. So, how long before someone else wants to pull this thing? We are 60 clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer to 75. Well, there is only one way to know for sure. 0 0.1 clicks. 0 0.2 clicks. 0 0.9, 2.1, 0 0.3 clicks, 4.5, 0 0.4 clicks, 0 0.5 clicks, 0 0.6 clicks. For the love of a block, stop counting clicks. We could enumerate all the ways in which our class was like that. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec, I promise. Right. I didn't think you'd actually come up. Maybe being on time is my new thing. Oh, right. We'll see about that when I have to get you up for school tomorrow. You know, I think I'm too old for that, too. Nice try, smart Alec. Sit. Don't worry, I'm not gonna sing. I like your singing. Well, you might be the only one. Go on, make a wish. You're officially a teenager. Look at all those girlfriends. Someone's gonna be really popular at school. Mom. What? You are very handsome. I'm sure all the girls are gonna be falling off. Mom. Home. What did you wish for? Why would I wish for anything? I've got everything I want. <laughs> oh, what huge favor are you about to ask me? Just 10 bucks. Dan, Andy, and I wanna go see Night of the Cosmos at the Rio tonight. A movie? Tonight. Come on, it's gonna be sick. It's about these zombies that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. I don't think I want you to see that, Peter. I let you watch the hockey mask one, and you were sleeping in my bed the next three nights. That was ages ago, and this one isn't even that bad. It's PG-13, and I'm 13. Exactly, PG-13 may contain violence and nudity. Mild nudity, like... Butts and stuff. You're not helping your case. No, I just, I, I wanted us to have some us time tonight, you know? Maybe finish our game. You can't duck out right when I'm about to win. We can still do all that stuff. Or some of it, tomorrow. You're always telling me to get out of the house more. A movie theater does not count as out of the house, and you know it. Pretty please? I don't know. Truck's still in the shop, and I don't want you walking alone in the dark. 
There's been a lot of weirdos out there. It's not safe. I'll be careful, Ma. I always am. Were you careful when you got that black eye? I told you I, I was... I know! You were standing up for someone, which is a good thing. But you cannot go punching your way out of every problem, Peter. I couldn't just stand there. No. Of course not. Okay, get me my purse. Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about. Something I want to give you. Twenty bucks? Don't push it. Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. You know, I was talking to Janie's mom the other day. Hey, Kubrick, buddy. No matter how long you wait here for Grandma and Grandpa, they're not coming back. Sorry. Will Dan and Andy be spending the night? You can all help me with the yard work in the morning. I knew there had to be a catch. I miss them so much. Grandma used to take me into town on Sundays to run errands. We'd stop for ice cream on the way home. Even in winter. Man, am I glad I finally got my hair the way I like it. Sometimes Grandma and Grandpa would let me sleep with them if I was too afraid down in the basement. I don't know much about art, but I know that this is excellent. Grandma really had talent. Jealous, my plan's better. You're green with envy. I'm sure you make a great point, Gamora, but I gotta go with Rocket. For reasons. Ha! Eat scut, Woolberry! And I mean, I know what I'm agreeing to, but just for everyone else. Can you explain that again? Look uh, what we've got After coming. we sell Groot, uh, we sneak back in and serious? use my tracking device yes, to find him to and find. bust him out. Lame. Guardians of the Galaxy. Never heard of you. Well, you do live on a mud ball in the middle of nowhere. What's that? What he means is, you will have. We're huge in the Kree system. What's in the box? A rare creature, last of his kind, and all-around swell guy. Looks like a bush. It is a tree. I'm Groot. A talking tree. That's new. All right, get going before I change my mind. And if the lady don't like it, I'll be carting out what's left of you in that box. Thanks, officer. Have a nice day. Officer? Whatever. Not exactly an easy way out if this all goes to hell. It's gonna go great. We got a killer monster and a solid plan. The tree is no killer. We should be selling the angry rodent. Lady Hellbender will be displeased. What? I'm supposed to be scared just because she's got hell in her name? She runs a glorified zoo. That's no zoo. It's a Flarkin army. Any chance they're the zookeepers with guns? I have never seen a Morthos tamed. I have seen one trample a man to pulp. It's fine. 
If worst comes to worst, we hightail it for the Milano. Unless she's got a fleet of Shi'ar dropships. Yeah, like she's got a bunch of ships to take her old monster mash on tour. No I stand correct. Those ain't she Oh, come on. Why did we not simply dock here and avoid the planet's inhospitable surface? Great question. Next time, I'm flying. Indeed. We needed time to iron out the plan. Now it's foolproof. Lady Hellbender is no fool. When her monster goes missing, she'll assume it was us. Assume, yes, but not no. Not chased across the galaxy level of no, at least. Are you flarkin' kidding me? Look at this place! It'll take forever to find fruit after we sell them. Peter Quill expects you to use your insect device. Bug! Alright, Gamora, looks like you're up. Makes sense. What? Like Scott she is! Look, Rocket, let's compromise. We'll use your tracker, but we'll all go. Fine, whatever. The Galeran Skull. That is truly a priceless trophy. Oh! A woman with expensive tastes. That's good news for our deal. Come on, we're a team. We stick together. All for one and one for all. That's surprisingly insightful. Did you just make that up? Uh, yep, just now. Totally off the top of my head. Follow me and pay attention. You will not approach Lady Hellbender's throne. If she chooses to approach you, you will remain still. No erratic movements. I am humbled by my green scoffings. Spare me your empty attitude. Apologies, my queen. I meant no offense. I know what you meant. Do not blame me for your food. You are not the first to claim they have captured a Tara Tara. You, you doubt its authenticity? It is what you say it is. Prove it. Or suffer the consequence of every other would-be con artist. I assure you, I said, milady. release it. We got this. Bring in the next seller and transfer 10,000 units to that last one's next of you. Speak. Hey there, I'm Star Lord. Okay. Drax the Destroyer. <laughs> the undoing of the Mad Titan in the flesh. And such flesh. Your presence honors me. You are much smaller than I expected. Oh? <laughs> and what were you expecting? Perhaps I can do something about it. But uh, unlikely. We'll see, Destroyer. I can be quite forceful. Peter Quill. I believe she is flirting with me.
Play along, man. Flatter her or something. You got this. Just for the best. Your negotiation skills are terrible. Lady Hellbender. I can see by the size of your weapon that you must be a skillful warrior. Hmm. Perhaps I can give you a demonstration sometime. You would make an acceptable opponent. Tell me, Destroyer, what brings you to Sagnarf 9? Peter Quill, show her the creature. Your kind had been wiped out. Name your terms, Destroyer. 20,000 units. 20,000? The creature is not monstrous like the creepy little beast. But it is a capable warrior and it possesses regenerative qualities. Also, it is the last of its species. 20,000 units is sufficient compensation. No. No? What do you mean, no? <sighs> I mean... No. Whoa! Rocky Drax has this. Name your terms, then. Fifteen thousand. And you stay. Whoa, you want to buy Drax? Not buy. Invest. I could use a warrior like you at my side. I have other commitments. Shame. <laughs> we could have had such fun together. Twelve thousand for the Flora Colossus, then. Twelve thousand is not Not nearby. that bad for a Flora... whatever deal. Twelve thousand units it is. Storms of Seknoff grow ravenous. You will stay among my Hellraisers and revel as one of us. Yeah, this is great. We'd be. Thank you. Flirting with a Signarfian beast handler. Who confirmed that Groot is definitely probably being kept in the new additions, Ben. Which is where exactly? Well, we didn't quite get that far. Good thing we're doing my plan. Tracker's pointing back to Lee Skull Suit's throne room, so uh, that's where I'm going. Tiny little problem. Boy, when these guys go, they go hard. Heavily inebriated. Doesn't mean they're not a threat. My best blade work happens after I've had a few. If a few scut knuckles gotta die to save Groot, so be it. Whoa, whoa, hey! We are not here to start a war with the woman who's got her own private army. Now does a rob her. If we do things right and be quiet, we'll be in and out with no one the wiser. Drax, what part of quiet don't you understand? Dead is quiet, Peter Quill. No killing! Don't touch anything, don't step on anything, and don't break anything. And don't do anything stupid. If we mess this up, it's game over for Groot. And us. Gotta hand it to the lady. She knows how to throw a party. It was like this with the Ravagers, too. 
Yondu was a real work hard, play hard sort. Thanos doing either usually ended up with murder. We comparing Scuddy father figures? Because mine gave me a shock collar for my birthday. Once we ditch this place, I'll show you guys a real party. Uh, I will construct festive headwear worthy of this celebration. Throne room entrance is down there, so we just gotta, you know, make our way across the chasm. Quietly. Gotta say, this is not what I had in mind when you pitched this whole hero for hire thing. Maybe Hellbender will give you a job. I'm not the one she was interested in. <laughs> She's right. We should have just sold Drax. Not pimps walking. And the plan is going just fine, as is. Still, we could have strung her along a little. Gotten us closer to Groot or something. Not just the sexual magnetism to set. Spoken like someone who's never dated. Not everyone has to trick someone into a date. That's it. Dead ahead. Past another bunch of lightweights. You're sure that tracker of yours is reliable? Trust me, this baby's paid for itself. Oh, you actually paid for it? I'm not in love with the whole track and groove thing, if I'm honest. What's the big deal? I got tabs on a lot of you. I think not. Think again, lady. You're right. 67 clicks away. Is that the Milano? You're lucky I didn't shove it out. No stalking teammates without their consent. Do your magic, Rocket. It is not magic. Just saying, have a little faith, Woolberry. My tech built them thumpers, it's gonna pop this door, and it'll find Groot. Am I good, or am I good? Those were the same options. Okay, the tracker says... Ah, come on, you skaggy. I knew that thing was junk. We saw him take Groot down the elevator, right? So we just gotta find the controls. Lady Ladi does probably got him on her fancy chair up there. We are down here. Hellbender used some sort of rising stairs. There's gotta be a way of activating them from ground level. Come on, buddy. Do something. What's wrong? Nothing. It's just, uh... If we can't find a switch, maybe we can get access to the circuitry itself. Maybe there's some stairs. There are several stairs. I mean stairs down to root. There's a perfectly good elevator. It's not perfectly good if we can't get it working. Then we better get it working. Drax, think you could lift this thing? Easily. But what do you want me to do with it? Still working on that. You sure that tracker is fixed? I told you, it ain't broke. I don't like our whole plan relying on some trinket. Well, unless you're hiding a map inside that jumpsuit, it's the best we got. It'll look better in orbit. Certainly. Where shall I move it? There's a control panel inside there you can hack. It's possible. All right, Drax, try to clear that rubble. At once. Let's see what's hiding back there. Signorfian night air is refreshing. Think you could have made more noise with that? Of course. But you did not ask. All right. I'm sending the schematic to your visor. Just follow the wiring and tell me which junctions to switch. Uh, here? Done. Cool. It changed. I can see it. Whoops. Must be Signorf soothing sounds, volume two. I believe those are monster mating calls. Okay, that's a little freaky. Switch this! Done! This one! Oh, here! Yep! Okay, here! And here! Got it! 
It's half powered, but I don't got enough juice to flip the circuit yet. There's got to be a second node. Okay. Switch the uh, here. Closing, closing, closing. Hey. We've got company. Is killing permitted now, Peter Quill? Yes, now. Kill them now. I'll enjoy that. Not ideal. Hey, no witnesses, no problem. Maybe Hellbender won't miss them. This one. Oh, oh the here. Yep. Uh, just a little slip. No big deal. For all we know, you may have just reconfigured the entire fortress. Nah, probably just lowered a height a bit or something. can't just have a normal friggin' ground level chair. It's intended to inspire fear in her adversaries. It's a crime of efficiency is what it is. Doesn't look too comfortable either. Okay, here. An elevator. And here? Got it. Switch. There. Keep it like that. I can get up to the throne now. You better hope that panel actually works, because I'm out of things to tinker with down here. Of course it'll work. Is the wrong elevator. What? He's right. Groot went down on the other side. Well, it's the only one we got, sweetheart. Sit. We're almost there. I gotta say, this is going pretty smooth. It has been considerably less than smooth. Okay. Yeah, we had that one kink, but at least no one raised the alarm. That's what you call a kink? It'll be smooth sailing from here. What the piece of scut? Right on cue. It's not that. Something's wrong. Heads up, more guards. I will give a wide berth, Peter Quill. Oh, come on, you hunk of chunk. Flark! Shh. Anyone else got a bad feeling all of a sudden? Rocket, keep it down. Stuff it, Quill. Groot's tracker just went dark. You said we're almost there. I'm sure he's fine. You ain't sure a scut. Groot! That could have gone better. Could have gone worse. At least he didn't wake anyone on his way. The rodent has tiny padded feet. Is it possible the rodent would leave without us after freeing the tree? No, he wouldn't. Maybe we should hurry up. Rocket, wait for us! Do not wait. Thanks, Drax. What's with this place and no railings? It's like they got the architect from the Death Star. I am not familiar with that installation. We should probably split up. Whoa! It's like a snot monster covered in pimples. Sounds like a teenager. Jeez, what sort of creature is bad enough that even Hellbender keeps it in a cage? Nope. 
Nope, don't do spider snakes or weird tentacle things. Did you sleep with a weird tentacle thing? Jillian was not weird. Rocky, we found him! Over here! Group! Easy there, bud. I'll get you out in a flat. Whoa! Hey, let's not turn him into kindling. Stand back. I will breach the perimeter. It's too thick. It's too thick. Who knew? That's it. Just like the Arago drop, bud. On three, two... Oh, that dashed witch scripted you down to your bark. You know, we'd have showed up sooner, but uh, it's way more close. Good to have you back, Root. Now all we need is an exit. Um, I guess Groot knows the way. Hey, wait up. What's going on? Say something. You okay, Groot? Shut it, Quill. What did I do? You're the one who insisted on this stupid plan. Now that freaking monster queen has... I don't know. Perhaps the tree has been witched. Hey, come on. Talk to me, bud. What did that Badoon Flarker do to you? Guardians of the galaxy. You fools thought you could cheat me and suffer no consequence. Groot. Which one of you thought it wise to entrust your absurd scheme to a Flora Colossus? You call him friend, yet you ignore his very nature, overlooking the fact that he is... The worst liar in history. I told you, he can't just pretend to be monstrous. To his credit, he kept your secret for almost an hour. Lady Hellbender, let us settle this honorably. I will face you in combat. Honorably? Your offer is worthless, Destroyer. There is no escaping my wrath! I can work with that. Dweller! Feast upon them! Talk about this! The time for 
For help, Peter Quill! Dracomora, cut him dead! Trash! You don't Kick stand their a chance! Kick their you! Ah, the beast is truly formidable! Die with honor! Well, we lost you for a second. Save your nice words for later, Quill! Not going into the light this time, little buddy! It will not be so fearsome when it has no arms! Just keep hitting it! Smoke the rocket! Do not cower behind your pet, Lady Hellbender! Just focus on the thing trying to kill us! You owe me one, Quill! What would I do without you, Rocket? What is next, Peter Quill? Now, attack! Let's do this! This has got my name on it! Now, hurt you! Get back in there, Tiger! Oh, you, Rocket! Put their life slashing me! Cut to the chase! Now this is a monster worthy of legend! If it bleeds, we can kill it! What does 
she feed this thing? No doubt, the flesh of its enemies. Now we know what kind of monster Hellbender likes. The kind that eats us. Next time, you're on your own. Not gonna chop you down that easy. We will need to tell this for one appendage at a time. Last up! My great we strength the hell, goes okay. underutilized! Destroy! <laughs> Do not cower behind your pet, Lady Hellbender! She doesn't look like she's cowering! Well, let's make it truly dead. It will not be so fearsome when it has no arms! Go, get them! Run!
Keep them busy, crew! Like we don't have enough problems already! I think it's trying to heal!
safe passage to Ultras, Peter Quill. We're about to... confounds us, Peter Quill. It seems we no longer remember how to fight. Oh, I remember, big guy. But these Flarknards are destined tough. Yes, it's tough out there. But have you forgotten who we are? We fear none. Flarkin' right. Because we've never known another way. Shoot from the gun, cross us, and you know you'll pay. Who's with me? Feel my wrath! Bring it on! Time the... What flavor do you think that one was? I don't know, but cutting into them is pretty fun, right? Lord, those things run hot! We're about to have more problems! That thing must get killer heartburn! Everybody strap in! Now that was a ride. 
no time to celebrate. We have made an awful mistake. And an awful amount of cash. There is no escaping Lady Hellbender's wrath. We'll see about that. What the? <laughs> She will hunt us to the end of the universe. Who gives a scud? We got off that mud ball with the money, didn't we? Only after the talking tree betrayed us. I am Groot. I do not speak tree, tree. Hey, you got a problem with Groot, you got a problem with me. Whoa, 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 one problem at a time. Lady Hellbender will seek her revenge, mark my words. Then she'll have to get in line. First, I gotta call Corel. The sooner we get this fine paid, the better. Yeah, so we can go back to focusing on being broke. That's weird. Is money all that you think of, Rodent? No, I also think about bombs. And booze. <gasps> bombs made out of booze. Nikki! Is it true? I really want to There's something wrong with the connection. Did you twist the thingy? Yeah, no dice. Nikki, is your mom around? I really need to talk to her. She's with me. Inside me. After we left, we went to the quarantine zone, I snuck aboard, and there was dark fog. Did you try narrowing the band? First thing I tried, it's gotta be something else. I'm losing you, Nick. Can you put your mom on? I knew you were my dad. I saw much light. I didn't know the Raker say it was a miracle. I think something has happened to the girl. <laughs> yeah, it's called she's Novacore. Can you fix it? <sighs> yeah, yeah, right. keep your star pants on. Right. I'll go check the array. Bring her back. I just have to... It's just an array. <laughs> just an array? Look at it, Quill. Where am I gonna get the parts to fix that? It's flarked! I told you it was a mistake to keep that thing. But did you listen to me? Oh, no, no, no! We don't listen to Rocket! He just has to fix the freaking ship! I promise we'll get it fixed soon. Yeah, just like you promised to get your girlfriend to go easy on us? Yeah, okay. Hey, that's not fair. You know what isn't fair, Quill? Being the only one who actually seems to give a scud about the Milano. Look, guys, we need the dock to fix the array. Luckily, I know a guy on Nowhere has got the parts we need, and he can get rid of that Nova track cheap. No, we cannot abandon the child. Her behavior was erratic. The llama thingy chewed the wires, Drax. It was probably just a bad connection. And if we remove the tracker, Corel will make sure the entire Nova Corps fleet is on alert for us. Gamora's right, we made a promise. I made a promise. See if you can pinpoint where Corel is. We pay the fine. Quill, are you freaking kidding me? That way, we don't have to keep looking over our shoulders for Nova on the next job. Yeah, if there is a next job. <laughs> 